Bilirubin is the yellow breakdown product of normal heme catabolism. Heme is found in hemoglobin, a principal component of red blood cells. Bilirubin is excreted in bile and urine, and elevated levels may indicate certain diseases. It is responsible for the yellow color of bruises, the background straw yellow color of urine, the brown color of feces, and the yellow discoloration in jaundice. It has also been found in plants. Chemistry Bilirubin consists of an open chain of four pyrrole like rings. In heme, these four rings are connected into a larger ring, called a porphyrin ring. Bilirubin can be conjugated with a molecule of glucuronic acid which makes it soluble in water. This is an example of glucuronidation. Bilirubin is very similar to the pigment phycobilin used by certain algae to capture light energy, and to the pigment phytochrome used by plants to sense light. All of these contain an open chain of four pyrrolic rings. Like these other pigments, some of the double bonds in bilirubin isomerize when exposed to light. This is used in the phototherapy of jaundiced newborns. The E, Z isomers of bilirubin formed upon light exposure are more soluble than the unilluminated Z, Z isomer, as the possibility of intramolecular hydrogen bonding is removed. This allows the excretion of unconjugated bilirubin in bile. Some textbooks and research articles show the incorrect geometric isomer of bilirubin. The naturally occurring isomer is the Z, Z isomer. Function Bilirubin is created by the activity of biliverdin reductase on biliverdin, a green tetrapyrrolic bile pigment that is also a product of heme catabolism. Bilirubin, when oxidized, reverts to become biliverdin once again. This cycle, in addition to the demonstration of the potent antioxidant activity of bilirubin, has led to the hypothesis that bilirubin's main physiologic role is as a cellular antioxidant. Metabolism Unconjugated, erythrocytes generated in the bone marrow are disposed of in the spleen when they get old or damaged. This releases hemoglobin, which is broken down to heme as the globin parts are turned into amino acids. The heme is then turned into unconjugated bilirubin in the reticular endothelial cells of the spleen. This unconjugated bilirubin is not soluble in water, due to intramolecular hydrogen bonding. It is then bound to albumin and sent to the liver. The measurement of direct bilirubin depends on its reaction with diazosulfenilic acid to create azobilirubin. However, unconjugated bilirubin also reacts slowly with diazosulfenilic acid so that the measured indirect bilirubin is an underestimate of the true unconjugated concentration. Conjugated, in the liver, bilirubin is conjugated with glucuronic acid by the enzyme glucuronyl transferase, making it soluble in water, the conjugated version is also often called direct bilirubin. Much of it goes into the bile and thus out into the small intestine. Though most bile acid is resorbed in the terminal ileum to participate in enterohepatic circulation, conjugated bilirubin is not absorbed and instead passes into the colon. There, colonic bacteria deconjugate and metabolize the bilirubin into colorless urobilinogen, which can be oxidized to form urobilin and stacobilin, these give stool its characteristic brown color. A trace of the urobilinogen is resorbed into the enterohepatic circulation to be re-excreted in the bile. Some of this is instead processed by the kidneys, coloring the urine yellow. Although the terms direct and indirect bilirubin are used equivalently with conjugated and unconjugated bilirubin, this is not quantitatively correct, because the direct fraction includes both conjugated bilirubin and ibilirubin. Furthermore, direct bilirubin tends to overestimate conjugated bilirubin levels due to unconjugated bilirubin that has reacted with diazosulfenilic acid leading to increased azobilirubin levels. Urine, under normal circumstances, a tiny amount of urobilinogen, if any, is excreted in the urine. If the liver's function is impaired or when biliary drainage is blocked, some of the conjugated bilirubin leaks out of the hepatocytes and appears in the urine, turning it dark amber. However, in disorders involving hemolytic anemia, an increased number of red blood cells are broken down, causing an increase in the amount of unconjugated bilirubin in the blood. Because the unconjugated bilirubin is not water-soluble, one will not see an increase in bilirubin in the urine. Because there is no problem with the liver or bile systems, 
The success unconjugated bilirubin will go through all of the normal processing mechanisms that occur and will show up as an increase in urine neurobilinogen. This difference between increased urine bilirubin and increased urine neurobilinogen helps to distinguish between various disorders in those systems. Toxicity, unconjugated hyperbilirubinemia in a newborn can lead to accumulation of bilirubin in certain brain regions with consequent irreversible damage to these areas manifesting as various neurological deficits, seizures, abnormal reflexes and eye movements. This type of neurological injury is known as conicterus. The spectrum of clinical effect is called bilirubin encephalopathy. The neurotoxicity of neonatal hyperbilirubinemia manifests because the blood or urobrain barrier has yet to develop fully, and bilirubin can freely pass into the brain interstitium, whereas more developed individuals with increased bilirubin in the blood are protected. Aside from specific chronic medical conditions that may lead to hyperbilirubinemia, Neonates in general are at increased risk since they lack the intestinal bacteria that facilitate the breakdown and excretion of conjugated bilirubin in the feces. Instead the conjugated bilirubin is converted back into the unconjugated form by the enzyme I-squared glucuronidase and a large proportion is reabsorbed through the enterohepatic circulation. Associated Health Benefits Recent research has indicated that in the absence of liver disease, individuals with high levels of total bilirubin may experience various health benefits exceeding those with lower levels of bilirubin. Studies have found higher levels of bilirubin in elderly individuals are associated with higher functional independence. Studies have also revealed that levels of serum bilirubin are inversely related to risk of certain heart diseases. Blood tests Bilirubin is degraded by light. Blood collection tubes containing blood or serum to be used in bilirubin assays should be protected from illumination. For adults, blood is typically collected by needle from a vein in the arm. In newborns, blood is often collected from a heel stick, a technique that uses a small, sharp blade to cut the skin on the infant's heel and collect a few drops of blood into a small tube. Non-invasive technology is available in some healthcare facilities that will measure bilirubin by using an instrument placed on the skin. Bilirubin is in one of two forms. Total bilirubin measures both BU and BC. Total and direct bilirubin levels can be measured from the blood, but indirect bilirubin is calculated from the total and direct bilirubin. Indirect bilirubin is fat soluble and direct bilirubin is water soluble. Measurement methods Originally the Van den Berg reaction was used for a qualitative estimate of bilirubin. This test is performed routinely in most medical laboratories and can be measured by a variety of methods. Total bilirubin is now often measured by the 2,5-dichlorophenyldiazonium method, and direct bilirubin is often measured by the method of Gendrasik and Groth. Blood levels The bilirubin level found in the body reflects the balance between production and excretion. Blood test results should always be interpreted using the reference range provided by the laboratory that performed the test, but typical, 0.3 to 1.9 mg per deciliter s for adults and, 340 a micron mole per liter, for newborns. Hyperbilirubinemia Hyperbilirubinemia results from a higher than normal level of bilirubin in the blood. For adult this is any level above 17 I 1 quarter mole per litre and for newborns 340 a micron mole per litre and critical hyperbilirubinemia 425 a micron mole per litre. Mild rises in bilirubin may be caused by the following, hemolysis or increased breakdown of red blood cells, Gilbert's syndrome a euro a genetic disorder of bilirubin metabolism that can result in mild jaundice, found in about 5% of the population, Rota syndrome non-itching jaundice, with rise of bilirubin in the patient's serum, mainly of the conjugated type. Moderate rise in bilirubin may be caused by pharmaceutical drugs, sulfonamides are contraindicated in infants less than two months old as they increase in conjugated bilirubin leading to conicterus. Hepatitis, chemotherapy, biliary stricture, very high levels of bilirubin may be caused by neonatal hyperbilirubinemia, where the newborn's liver is not able to properly process the bilirubin causing jaundice, unusually large bile duct obstruction, for example stone in common bile duct, tumor obstructing common bile duct etc. 
severe liver failure with cirrhosis, Crigler a Euro Najjar syndrome, Dubin a Euro Johnson syndrome, Collidocolithiasis. Cirrhosis may cause normal, moderately high or high levels of bilirubin, depending on exact features of the cirrhosis. To further elucidate the causes of jaundice or increased bilirubin, it is usually simpler to look at other liver function tests, blood film examination or evidence of infective hepatitis. Jaundice Jaundice may be noticeable in the scura of the eyes at levels of about 2 to 3 mg per deciliter, and in the skin at higher levels. For conversion, 1 mg per deciliter equals 17.1 a micron mole per liter. Jaundice is classified depending upon whether the bilirubin is free or conjugated to glucuronic acid into conjugated jaundice or unconjugated jaundice. Urine tests, urine bilirubin may also be clinically significant. Bilirubin is not normally detectable in the urine of healthy people. If the blood level of conjugated bilirubin becomes elevated, for example due to liver disease, excess conjugated bilirubin is excreted in the urine, indicating a pathological process. Unconjugated bilirubin is not water-soluble and so is not excreted in the urine. Testing urine for both bilirubin and urobilinogen can help differentiate obstructive liver disease from other causes of jaundice. See also, biliary atresia, bilirubin de glucuronide, biliverdin, Crigler a Najjar syndrome, Gilbert's syndrome, a genetic disorder of bilirubin metabolism that can result in mild jaundice, found in about 5% of the population. H. Wise Law, Primary Biliary Cirrhosis Primary sclerosing cholangitis, references. External links, bilirubin, analyte monograph from the Association for Clinical Biochemistry and Laboratory Medicine.